ஹலோ எவ்ரி ஒன் வெல்கம் டு த நிஃப்டி ப்ரொடிக்ஷன் வீக்லி வீடியோ சீரீஸ் ஐ எம் பிஎல் குரு இக்விட்டி மார்க்கெட்ஸ் ஆர் அண்டர் ப்ரெஷர் நிஃப்டி ஃபெல் லாஸ்ட் வீக் த ரைசிங் யூஎஸ் சீல்ஸ் த இஸ்ரேல் ஹமாஸ் வார் டென்ஷன் ஆர் கீப்பிங் த ஸ்டாக் மார்க்கெட்ஸ் அண்டர் ப்ரெஷர் நிஃப்டி அண்ட் நிஃப்டி பேங்க் இண்டெக்ஸ் ஃபெல் லாஸ்ட் வீக் ஹவ் அவர் ஆன் த சார்ட்ஸ் நிஃப்டி இஸ் நாட் லுக்கிங் வெரி வீக் தெர் ஆர் சப்போர்ட்ஸ் ஃபார் த நிஃப்டி கம்மிங் அப் விச் கேன் லிமிட் த டவுன் சைட் பட் நிஃப்டி பேங்க் இஸ் லுக்கிங் மச் வீக்கர் தென் த நிஃப்டி இட் ஹேஸ் மோர் ரூம் டு ஃபால் ஃப்ரம் கரண்ட் லெவல்ஸ் Dow Jones is also coming up with a strong supports below current levels. So, Nifty and the Dow Jones can bounce back from current levels. Let us now look at the charts and see where the supports are there for the Nifty and Dow Jones and how far can the Nifty Bank Index fall. Nifty fell last week. But if we look at the chart, there is a range of 19500 to 19850 over the last couple of weeks. So, looking at the charts, there is no major threat for the broader uptrend. Also, there is support at 19400. Broadly, 19400 to 19850 can be the trading range for now. As long as Nifty stays above 19400, the outlook will remain bullish. So, the chances are high for it to break 19850 and rise to 20,000 first and then to 2300 and 2400. Nifty will come under more selling pressure only if it breaks below 19400. If that happens, we can see a fall to 19100 and 19000. Nifty Bank Index is looking much weaker than Nifty. Last week, we said that the index can bounce back from the support around 43,650. That view could be going wrong. The index looks very weak and can fall to 42,800 and even 42,000 in the coming weeks. However, from a long-term perspective, this fall will be a very good buying opportunity. To avoid this fall, Nifty Bank Index has to rise back from here itself and break above 45,000. Only in that case, the outlook will turn bullish for a rise to 46,000 and higher levels. Dow Jones index has crucial supports at 32850 and 32700. The index has to sustain above these supports to avoid more fall. Resistance is around 34300. Dow Jones has to see a decisive break above 34300 to regain its bullish momentum. Only then the doors will open again for a rise to 35500 and higher levels. The price action this week is going to be very important. To sum up, Nifty Bank index is looking much weaker than the Nifty and the Dow Jones. Nifty and Dow Jones has strong supports coming up below current levels. Nifty has supports at 19400. For now, 19400 to 19850 can be the trading range. As long as Nifty trades above 19400, the bias is bullish. The chances are high for the Nifty to break above 19850 and move up to 20000 first and then to 20400 thereafter. In case Nifty breaks below 19400, it can see an extended fall up to 19100 and 19000. Nifty Bank Index is looking much weaker than the Nifty. It can fall up to 42,800 and even 42,000. However, such a fall will be a very good buying opportunity from a long-term perspective. Dow Jones has supports at 32,850 and 32,700. A bounce from this support will be a very good positive sign from a long-term perspective. That will open up the doors for a fresh rally and take the Dow Jones higher in the coming weeks. If you have any questions on F&O, please write to derivatives at the hindu.co.in. To know the outlook on specific stocks that you are holding and get advice on whether to book profit or hold it or buy more, write to techtrail at thehindu.co.in. For any queries on mutual funds, email to mf at thehindu.co.in. For any questions, clarifications on investments, personal finance, write to blportfolio at thehindu.co.in. To get more insights on investments, personal finance, stocks and commodity picks for short and long term based on technical analysis, as well as fno strategies subscribe to bl portfolio section from the link that you see on your screen please note that the outlook given in this video is based on technical analysis these are strictly not trade recommendations if you want to trade this view please read the detailed index outlook article published in our website in the portfolio section the link of the article is given below in the description